Alright, so we're here at First Class Firearms. Um, I'm here with Pete from First Class, and we're gonna go over the disassembly of the IAC Hawk 982. Okay, the 982, the difference between the 982 and the 981 is that the 982 comes with gold spring sights, as you can see. Alright, so let's follow some uh, simple uh, gun safety rules. Uh, the first one is we're always gonna keep the gun pointing in a safe direction, and we have designated to the left as our safe direction. We'll keep our finger off the trigger until we're ready to fire, and we're going to keep the gun unloaded until we're ready to use it. So, we're going to verify that the firearm is clear. There's no round in the chamber. We're going to physically and visually check, and there's no round in the tube. Okay? And I'm going to have Pete verify as well that the firearm is clear. Nope, yep, all clear. Clear? Okay. So, the firearm is clear. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to close the action. We're going to take off the magazine tube cap. And by, to do that, all you gotta do is just turn it. Okay. And what, I, what we recommend is kind of just laying your parts out in order. That way you can kind of remember to put it back in order. All right. After that, what you wanna do is you wanna press the uh, action um, release lever right here at the bottom. Press that, open your action about halfway, like so, and take the barrel out. We'll set that down. Then what we're going to want to do is we want to make sure, now you can take it down all the way to the point of taking the trigger group out, but for this video we're not going to do that. You probably don't need to do that every single time you go shooting, um, but if it's been a while since you've um, cleaned your firearm, you may want to do that. And it's real simple, there's two um, trigger pins right here. Get a, the appropriate punch, punch these out, they're real simple to do, and then the trigger group just comes right out. Okay. So from this point, we want to take the, uh, the forend off with the bolt. So you want to be very careful with that. And to do so, okay, and of course you can get a good shot. Inside here, you'll see two, uh, what they, you know, on the Remington uh, diagram, it says uh, left side, right side, shell latch, okay? And it's these little bars. You'll feel it inside on the left side and on the right side. So what you want to do is you want to keep your shotgun upright press that action release bar and it comes slides right out. Okay, there's your bolt. Okay, and then this is your forend right here. And essentially, you have a properly stripped Remington, or IAC, which is a Remington 870 knockoff. Uh, but it's a very solid shotgun and it's, um, all the 870 parts will fit on the shotgun. Um, I think it's very sturdy compared to my 870. The barrel, the fit and finish seems to be pretty good. You know, you just can't beat it for the price. Um, you know, plus with the Ghost Ring sights. A any comments? Yeah, you pretty much covered it all. Yeah, I mean, it's real simple to take down. And uh, so let's uh, put it back together. So the first thing you want to do again is grab your forehand. You're going to put that on your tube, your magazine tube. All right. Now, before you put it back in, you have to make sure you're Shotgun is upright. You're going to lay your bolt in first, and then you're going to slide it in. Now, as you slide it in, don't jam it in there. Just lightly slide it in. Lift up the, the elevator right here. Push in on the right latch, and then push in on the left latch, and it should slide right in. Okay, so the right side first, then the left side. And then just goes right back in. Now, again, you're going to open up your bolt or your um, action about halfway, grab your barrel, line it up, slide it in there, close the bolt up, and then grab your magazine uh, cap, and turn it back on, all right? And then, again, we wanna function check it. So, I'm gonna rack the uh, shotgun three times, one, I'm going to take it off safe and pull, press the trigger three times. One, two, three. Okay, and then put the safety back on and then pull the trigger. 
make sure that it is not engaging the hammer. And there you go. That is the proper way to disassemble and reassemble a Hawk uh, 982 or a 981.